Ever since I started baking, I have learned a secret ingredient that adds special taste for everything that you bake, that is baking with love. And when it comes to a pizza, you need a lot of love. And today, I'm gonna show you how I made a pizza. Let's begin by mixing up the dry ingredients. That is. Two cups of flour and one half teaspoon of salt, half teaspoon of garlic powder, and two tablespoon of milk powder. This makes our dry ingredients. Let's mix it up and keep it aside. Now here comes the wet ingredients. To bloom the yeast, we need one cup of warm water. 1 teaspoon of sugar, mix it well and add 2 teaspoon of yeast. Now stir it up. You can see the bubbles rising up. Leave it for 10 minutes. Yeast is now ready. Let's mix it with the flour. Use your hand to knead well. Between add 2 teaspoons of butter, then continue kneading, say about 10 minutes. Once you have a beautiful dough, moist the bowl with olive oil and clean wrap it. Leave it for 1 hour. This is the best part I like, that is chopping. We need to arrange the toppings now. We'll start with onions. When it comes to topping, there are no specific rules. You may consider your favorite layers of veggies or non-veg. You can cut julienes and make it half, let's say half julienes. It's all up to you, the way you want. So the toppings are sausage, green pepper, yellow pepper, red pepper, orange pepper. And the last one, black olives and chili pepper. It's almost in an hour. Let's check the dough. Dough has risen. We shall knead it again for a few minutes to make it more smooth. Let's roll it up. Here I'm using a roller. If you don't want to use a roller, you can simply press it and stretch it and fit it in a pan. I'm using a 13 inch pan and the measurement taken is sufficient for a 13 inch pan. Make a border by pushing at the edge and poke it little bit so that it will not rise up. Also coat the edge with butter or olive oil. And this is the base of our topping. I'm using a pizza sauce. You can mix the pizza sauce with chili paste, any flavor you like. Here I'm using chili pesto as the second base. If you want to make it more spicy, add some chili flakes. And I like it hot. Add some oregano.
it's time to shred a layer of cheese now be generous more cheesy more juicy and now start with the sausage as i said before there is no specific rules you can have your own designs your own combination your own flavors we have completed the topping by adding onion and all colors of the bell pepper and lastly chili pepper and black olives Finally I am going to cover this layer again with some cheese. Yes, a lot of cheese because I love cheese. Let's bake it in an oven at 180 degrees for about 20 to 30 minutes. I hope you are enjoying this video. If you like it, please don't forget to subscribe my channel. Yes. Our homemade version of pizza is ready. Looks beautiful. Definitely delicious, especially when baked with a lot of love. When it comes to kids at home, it's always on high demand. So try out, and I'm sure it's gonna bring a smile on little faces. I hope you like this video, and do let me know your comments. Thanks for watching.